Hi, I'm Dr. Chris Stevenson. And I'm Dr. Rob Duller. And we are lecturers in earth science at the University of Liverpool. So, what is earth science? Earth science uses biology, chemistry, physics and maths to try and understand the world around us. And, importantly, the rocks beneath our feet. What? Everything around us? Yeah, pretty much, Rob. OK, so what about sand and mud? You wouldn't think it, but actually sand and mud have controlled the development of human civilization throughout history. They contain essential minerals and nutrients for things to grow in the ground. OK, so what about trees and forests? Well, Rob, life has been around on the planet for a very long time about three and a half billion years. What's more, life has changed the very atmosphere of the planet from a poisonous nightmare into an oxygen-rich uh, atmosphere that is a delight to breathe. <sighs> life has made the very air that we breathe today. And it's all Earth science. Ooh. What about the atmosphere and the ocean? The oceans fundamentally regulate the chemistry and dynamics of our atmosphere. They regulate the heat the Earth absorbs from the sun. And they dictate weather patterns and climate right around the world. So what about raw materials and building materials? Well, Rob, building materials come out of the ground. And that means Earth scientists have to find them. Whether it's clay materials, making bricks, or whether it's quarrying limestone and finding aggregates to build concrete structures like this. So I suppose you're going to tell me that Earth Sciences has something to do with mobile phones, tablets and car batteries. There's gold in your SIM card, there's copper wiring in the circuit boards, the whole thing's made of plastic, there are rare earth elements in the touchscreen technology. So your mobile phone has a load of natural resources in it that Earth scientists have to find. Ah, so what you're saying is, is that Earth sciences is also about the environment, climate and society. Well, and that's not all. When we look at rocks, we're looking back in the Earth's history over millions of years. Oh, right. So you mean like Sherlock Holmes, but only with a hammer and a hand lens. And rocks can tell us all sorts of things about the past, from long extinct creatures and ecosystems, like the dinosaurs, to ancient paleoclimates. So Earth sciences is how we know about global warming? Yeah, that's right, Rob. Understanding the chemistry and dynamics of climates of the past tells us what's going on today, and what our climate is going to be like in the future. So let me get this straight. Earth Sciences is about the environment and how it works. It's about climate and how it's changing. And also provides us with those raw materials we need to build a more sustainable future society. So to save our planet, we must understand our planet study earth sciences at university and make a difference that's really good one yeah nice one <laughs>